Thierry Henry is caught up in a conflict of interest. Seri's been spotted in London. Fernando Torres moves to Japan. Riyad Mahrez might finally get his move to Manchester City. And we have the rumour report where I rate the likelihood of these weird and wonderful rumours actually happening as transfers. That and more coming up in the next few minutes. As I'm your host, Matt Froelich, you are the one footballers, and this is the Daily News. First off, there's a rather interesting subplot to tonight's World Cup semi-final between France and Belgium, as the Red Devils' assistant manager is none other than French legend and 1998 World Cup winner Thierry Henry. Will he secretly be hoping that the French side progress into the final, or will he stay professional and do his utmost to help the Belgian team? Either way, he's probably in for a lot of abuse post-match. From the France team to a France-based player and it's Nice's Jean-Michael Serri who looks to be set for a move to Chelsea. Yesterday he was spotted in London which makes the transfer rumours all that more concrete. However, he could have just been on there on holiday, but that's never going to stop the rumour mill going into absolute overdrive. But someone who definitely won't be spotted in the capital city over the next few days is Riyad Mahrez as he looks set to complete his move from the Midlands up north as Leicester and Manchester City have agreed on a £60 million deal for the Algerian. He'll join up with Pep Guardiola's squad this week for pre-season as they start preparations to defend their league title, potentially alongside Jorginho as the Napoli midfielder could also join this week. Up next we have another Spaniard who's followed in the footsteps of Andres Iniesta by moving to Japan. After his contract expired this summer, 34-year-old Fernando Torres has joined Sagantosu in the J-League. However, his new side midway through the season sits second bottom, whereas Iniesta's Vissel Kobe sit in sixth place of the 18-team league. And finally, we move on to something a little different called the Transfer Rumour Report. Basically, I'll throw a few rumours out and I'll rate them from 1 to 10 on how likely they're going to happen. 1 being as unlikely as Neymar staying on his feet and 10 being as likely as football coming home. So here we go. Up first is Angel Di Maria to Napoli. To be honest, I can't see him being fourth choice attacker behind Mbappe, Cavani and Neymar for much longer, so this could happen. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Next up is Damogoy Vida to Liverpool. And at 29, this really could represent the Croatians' final chance at a move to a big European club. It seems likely to happen. I'll give it an 8 out of 10. Lastly is Wilfred Zaha to Tottenham, and I can't see Mauricio Pochettino spending £50 million on someone who won't be starting every week. To me, it seems highly unlikely. 4 out of 10. So there's the rumour report. Don't forget to give me your ratings on how likely you think they are to happen in the comments section below. That's all from me for now. Make sure you stay up to date with all the World Cup and OneFootball content over on OneFootball TV. But until next time, I'll see you guys later. All this gold and Patron, I'm on gold and Patron Only 10 in the morning, I might fuck around and drink all of this shit Smoking those on the way, cold in inside of my switch Should have compliment all of my hits